Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Catman Joe and welcome back to another brand new video. Today guys, we are back once again with another brand new Minecraft build tutorial guys. And today we're continuing on from where we set off last time guys. We're continuing our village build series guys. Now this one is how to build a church and this has been a really hard tutorial to make for you guys. Um, it'll be really simple for you guys to understand since you only really have to do one of these builds. But for me personally, I had to do 12 of these guys to show you how to do it step by step by step and I had to find all the materials, how much you needed to build it, all that good stuff, but I'm sure it'll be worth it guys, I'm sure you guys will definitely show some love. So if you guys can, please do drop a like down below, it really does only take a second guys, and it would, it would be very, very, very appreciated guys. Also, if you're new to the channel, please be sure to subscribe because I upload daily Minecraft tips, tricks, tutorials, and glitches, much like this guys. And other than that, let's jump right into the tutorial. So guys, today we're going to be building the villager church. Now, this is one of the main things in any village, guys. Any village in Minecraft, this is one of the major things in it, guys. This is the main build in the entire village, guys. By the end of the tutorial, you guys will find out exactly how to build all of this, how to add in basically every single floor detail, and to do the roof itself, guys. So let's just go and do this, guys. Let me just run down here. Oh. Sorry. Now, also just to say, by the way, guys, last time, um, or you know, on Monday's video, Monday's video was this, guys. How to build these? Um, if you guys haven't seen it yet, you guys can go check it out like any time right now. It'll probably be in the description below or at the end of the video, guys. And um, but this was a wood hut, and we also bought, I think, what was it? The average small house. I'm pretty sure it was small house. Yeah. Um, and I showed you guys how to build these, which it was really awesome. It was a really great tutorial. So if you guys definitely um want to learn how to build these, go check out that tutorial. You know, it's really easy to find. It will be at the end of the video, and it'll probably pop on the pop up on the screen sometime soon, guys. So let's just jump right into it. So the materials you're going to need for this, by the way, guys, are going to be here. This is your shopping list in here, right? So I'm going to show you guys this in a second. But let me tell you the spacing. So you're going to need a five by nine, five wide, and nine space back, and a twelve high area. Meaning, obviously, by the way, guys, this is um this is only like nine long, not including the stair. If you guys are building it like this. Um, it will obviously include the it will obviously include the stair, which means it will be ten long in total. Um, but I mean, if you're not and you're building it kind of like built into the ground, these ones are above the ground. So I mean, if you guys were building it like this kind of thing, let me just give you guys a quick little example like this, like that. You know, like so it'd be rather than actually climbing up into it, you'd actually just walk straight into it. Then obviously it would just be nine. But um, yeah, guys, we're gonna build it with the stairs um, as we averagely do, guys. <laughs> so it'll be five wide, which three at the front, like this, guys. Um, and then it comes five here and then three at the back and it's nine long so let me tell you guys how to do this so you guys want to begin by placing your stair down you also want to look here and just go at nine back so one two three four five six seven eight nine make it like this so three wide and nine back and then right here guys come one back from there and make a four part here you should have a uh, you guys should have a gap by four here as well and then you guys go that is the easiest part that's how you do the like the actual frame the beginning part of the bow guys inside the chest this is what you guys are going to need for building this by the way you guys will need six cobblestone stairs three stacks of cobblestone you're also going to need 13 extra cobblestone 15 glass panes you guys can use normal glass if you want um, i just suggest glass panes because they look a lot they do look a lot nicer um, also you're going to need 10 ladders and one iron door sorry oak door sorry and that is everything you guys are going to need for this build once you guys have built your frame, you guys are going to want to move on to the second floor in the next level. This is where your door is going to get used, guys. You're going to end up placing your door right here. You're going to basically just imitate what you've already done, except for I'm going to be adding in the stairs part. Now, I'm actually going to have to show you guys how to do this. I uh, kind of underline it so you guys don't know how to do this part without any mistakes. But you guys notice this little part here. This is like an overhanging part. You guys will have to do this. So all you guys basically have to do is just build up from there and bring it all the way up here. And then put one here, one here, and then do this the exact same as that on this side here, guys, like this. Then come around the back and just extend it up, guys. So let me just show you how these stairs are going to work. So what you guys are going to do is you guys are going to want to place one row of, um, what's it called, cobblestone. Then a stair, then cobblestone, cobblestone, then a stair, then a stair. So you'll have this little gap looking kind of thing, guys. So, you know, I'm sure you guys will understand. I just want to show you guys that. Kind of underline it to show you guys how it'll look or how it'll work. Once you guys have done that, you guys are going to, you guys are going to be moving on to your third part, which is technically like the third floor. Um, or the third level kind of out of the whole 12 of them this is the third one now guys you're basically going to want to be kind of just adding on to the kind of oh but already the build that you've just done so you're going to basically just do this guys on the side you're going to be adding in your windows here you're going to be adding in your two ladders i didn't do that on this one i'm sorry about that um, but you're going to be adding in your ladders here guys so just do this exact thing 
now above these parts here as i said you're basically just going to be like placing one up like just raising everything up by one except from like, these parts where you place the windows and um, but at the back here once you guys have done this you guys are going to leave a gap in the middle and then put a stair here and a stair here this is kind of like where the priest would say um, i know stand and like tell everybody i know about whatever he tells everybody i suppose that's you know this is what that kind of that part's for there next part you're kind of going to be you know getting close to capping it off this is the fourth level i believe inside it's basically nothing's changed except from you've upped the floor by one so just going around one more time you're going to like cap off the actual doorway now so there is no like hole above it it's completely capped off you're going to come around the sides and make these windows too high and um, leave a gap by three of cobblestone then place this window here cobblestone come around here do the exact same come around here and do the exact same as the opposite side here and there you guys go now <laughs> moving on to i believe the fourth is it no wait one two three four five sorry the fifth one now you're actually going to be capping off the first floor guys so if you guys see the inside no longer will you be working on the inside part here there'll be nothing else coming in this part here guys you have the option to place torches if you do desire that if you guys want to keep it kind of bright and lit up you guys can do that but nothing else will be happening in the inside simply what you're going to want to do is add one more floor above here like this guys putting this little slant or this little lip part even hanging over this now at the back, um, at the back here, guys, you're gonna you're gonna want to keep extending your ladders all the way up here, guys. Then you're gonna want to close off this part like this, and there you guys go. You'll have a three by three gap left here that will be still left wide open, and that's how you do this floor, guys. Moving on to the next one, you're gonna be doing the exact same basically as what you guys just done there, but now we're except from working on the average normal floor, we're actually working on the tower, guys. So add another ladder, build a three wide gap here, three wide here, making it look kind of something like this pretty straightforward um, I'm again leaving this little lip part here and um, but just do this guys all the way around then making sure you guys have extended this part here all the way back and um, this will kind of just keep the roof kind of closed off and it'll look a lot more nicer obviously um, and then well, guys that is basically it, I believe Um, I think I'm missing some I feel like I'm missing something I don't I know I don't think we are guys um, but then for the next part here just going to come across here again just expand and um, expanding or extending up from there going to want to start adding in your windows now extend the ladders up one more again put in these parts here now every middle gap all the way around you're going to want to put your windows guys really straightforward and really easy to do um, but that is what you'll need to do for this floor for the next floor once again i just copying it's really just rinse and repeat kind of thing guys um, but for the next floor you're going to be wanting to add this in this will be two window high your windows will be now made too high you're also going to be wanting to add in your ladder once again so it goes all the way from the bottom all the way up here like this um, and you guys should have something that looks kind of like that uh, pretty straightforward pretty simple next part you're going to be capping off this kind of thing or getting close to capping it off you're going to want to add the actual roof to all the windows like this guys add in another ladder again because we're just about on the top floor guys but adding another ladder again all the way around like this and um, basically giving it this kind of look in the inside guys now i don't know if anyone wants to add anything in here personally the villages don't actually have anything in here but you guys can if you want you guys can design whatever you guys want and do what you want with the build do what you wish even but um i'm just saying for this part here i mean this is what i am the average build actually is guys and also by the way just let you know nothing else is happening to the back nothing at all this is all just being left now all this stuff here let me just fix that like this sorry guys uh, moving on to the next part guys um again it's, i know it's kind of boring I'm, I'm sure someone's watching going you know it's not really the greatest instructions but i'm pretty sure it's quite straightforward just need to follow along working on each floor next part you're just going to be completely capping the entire place off putting one more layer above it so where you guys just done this capping off the window you're going to want to put another whole floor above it leaving this another little lip look about it and um, having this little kind of like hanging off part here coming all the way around and then leaving a hole for the stairs guys because this is going to be where you're going to be walking guys this is going to be the top of the tower then once you guys have done this you guys want to simply just add in these parts here which are going to be kind of like the finishing touches remember to keep that lip part in because i know it does look kind of random guys but it is the whole design of the village church um i mean if you guys want to remove it that is your choice i just suggest i you know my suggestion is you know don't remove it but then once you guys have done this um you want to stop extend by the way you guys want to stop bringing your ladder up anymore you want to leave it where it is kind of thing extend it like that come across here and then finally just add in the last part which is these little things coming along these are like the i know what you call them just a little bits of stone that kind of come in between so you can kind of still look down and uh yeah that's basically it guys so let's go have a look um let's go have a quick little look inside our place this is what you guys should end up with and it's really simple if i do go a little bit too fast feel uh, feel more than three or three even to actually pause the video anytime and just kind of have a little run over how it will look and how to do it guys and yeah that is how you do it guys that's how you build the villager church guy uh, the villager church guys 
and um, yeah i hope you guys really did go to enjoy this video it was really hard to do actually to build all 12 of these little replica buildings coming one floor up at a time it is really irritating i can assure you guys but it is worth it i'm sure i'm sure um, everyone will enjoy it i keep saying sure <laughs> but um anyway guys thank you for watching today's video if you guys really did go to enjoy it please be sure to drop a like down below it only does take a second guys and it really 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 is appreciated and it helps out these videos a ton also if you're new to the channel be sure to subscribe because i upload daily minecraft tips tricks tutorials and glitches much like this one and other amazing build tutorials like this on my channel and other than that thank you for watching today's video i'll see you on tomorrow's and peace out guys wherever love goes there is also misery it's no mystery and you and I, we got history, yeah Wherever love flows, there is also tragedy When we're in too deep And you and I, we got history, yeah